popular restaurant chain under fire accused of causing a local man's death. The father of three died of a salmonella infection, his family claims, after eating at a Boston market. News Channel 5's Wanda Moore is live in Boynton Beach with details of the lawsuit and the restaurant's response. Wanda? Well, the lawsuit alleges that this Boston market here in Boynton Beach violated health regulations, specifically employees not washing their hands. And tonight the question is, is that what caused the death of Gary Kidwell? His death has just left a huge hole in our hearts. It was just another day for 39-year-old Gary Kidwell when he entered this Boston market in Boynton Beach in November of 2014 and ordered a turkey platter. Shortly afterward, he fell ill. The diagnosis at the hospital, salmonella poisoning. Unfortunately, Gary Kidwell did pass away as a result. Kidwell, a father of three, fought for his life for three months, a fight he did not win. It's been very hard. According to the lawsuit, the health department conducted an investigation of that Boston market location as a result of Kidwell's food poisoning. Investigators found several violations, including employees not washing their hands. It's quite possible that the actions of the employees of Boston Market and the actions of Boston Market itself created an unreasonable risk of harm to customers. The Boston Market location in Boynton Beach remains open. In a statement to WPTV, the company said, to date, the plaintiff's attorneys have not produced any evidence that Mr. Kidwell ate at the Boston Market. The restaurant goes on to say that, quote, health department inspections prior to and immediately following the alleged incident in 2014 resulted in no follow-up by the health department. For Kidwell's family, I just don't want to see this happen to anyone else. Nothing can bring him back to them. The family is seeking an undisclosed amount in that lawsuit, and they're telling me they really just want to make sure that there's more transparency for customers going forward. They're citing the example of New York, where the health department puts up grades on the doors of the restaurants after an inspection for everyone to see. Reporting live in Boynton Beach, Wanda Moore, WPTV News Channel 5.